Hey bud, how's it going? If you're new to the channel, then welcome. Take a seat. And if you're coming back, CJ, I don't think the Postal Service is a place for women. It's male dominated. Welcome back to another movie commentary. My name is Sam. Steph. And we're the movie buds. Okay, so for anyone wondering, I caught the spicy cough. I'm isolating at the moment, which is why we've uh, had to split up the screen, but should be fine by the next video. But today, though, we are doing The Incredibles. Yeah, so we've both seen this movie. It's a classic. I think most people have. It'd be pretty hard to have missed it, right? Mm-hmm, yeah. Saw it in cinemas, got it on DVD, and watched the ever-loving crap out of it. I know this movie pretty much scene for scene. Okay, well, I've only seen it like two <laughs> or three times, but I do enjoy it quite a bit. Steph, you're wearing the hoodie. I am, yes. On the back, I mean, it's a bit hard with this situation I got here, but <laughs> I'll go hard sun hoodie, and I'll probably just put up a screenshot from yeah. the actual website where you can get it. Yay! Yay! <laughs> All right. This is something. That's fine. Can break through walls, I just can't. <laughs> I kind of love how it starts out in the, like, 4-4 or whatever. Relatable. Yeah, we recently had to figure those out, too. Do you right. have a secret identity? Yeah, I don't know a single one who doesn't. Who wants the pressure of being super all the time? I mean, some people might. Yeah, definitely some superheroes. Have, uh, like, that's their whole deal, you know, public identity and all that. Of course I have a secret identity. I would want to go shopping as Elastigirl, you know what I mean? Super ladies always trying to tell you their secret identity. I mean, you tell me you are an ultra lightning babe. Samuel L. Jackson is such a fucking good pick for this shit. I'm good. <laughs> well, though he only cares about the super persona. <laughs> oh, yeah. No matter how many times you save the world, manages to get back in jeopardy again. Just want it to stay safe. No shit, but obviously it doesn't work that way. Yeah, well, I mean, I mean, hell, man, all you're really doing is shedding a light on the plight of essential workers here. <laughs> I think I just like the simple life and raise a family. Settle down, are you kidding? Leave the saving of the world to the men? I don't think so. I did love that detail yeah. as well, but it's like, yeah, it's set in the 60s. Bob uh -huh. is a little more 50s, Helen's a little more, like, forwards with it. Progressive, you know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> You mean the initial setting is in the 60s, yeah? Yeah, the setting of the yeah. story is in the 60s. Not here. I'm pretty sure this is like, yeah, like 10 years prior. This is 50s? Do you mean that, like, the main story that we're a part of is set in the 60s? Yeah, isn't it? It's like it's uh -huh. inspired by the 60s. It takes place in a specific time period. Well, if I want to find out, I'll put it up on screen. Like, it's obvious that where we're starting here with them being young, it's probably like, I don't know, 50s ish. Yeah, probably like mid, late but 50s. But how or far? further down it is after that. I mean, I guess 60s or 70s makes sense. Yeah. Deadly high-speed pursuit. Yeah, I've got time. The number of times I've seen that used in memes and shit. <laughs> yeah. It's become one of those moments, so. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. damn, bro. What a setup. I know. I did love even the forethought of having it that's like, yeah, no, there's like this other billionaire who bankrolls everyone else. Although that's why pretty much all super teams have the one billionaire. Yeah, right? My cat squeaker won't come down. Aww. But I suggest you stand clear. He's quite tight. He <laughs> sounds Aussie. That always confused me. There's one random random Aussie lady in this American city. <laughs> Do you really think this is the best way to deal with this situation? <laughs> that shakes the cat. <laughs> <laughs> you heard a squeak oh the cat, now shake the cat. <laughs> we have a tour bus robbery. I've still got time. Have you though? Are they robbing the tour bus or are they being robbed by a tour bus? Mm. Cool, ready for takeoff. What the? Well, I'm incredible. Oh my god, yeah. Yeah. You're that kid from the fan club. Bro, Brody, but buddy. It's incredible. Just Is it? wildly overzealous. No, no, no. You don't have to worry about training me. I know all your moves. I am your number one fan. Um, I do think he has to worry about training if yeah. he, he was at all going to be involved with you. Yeah. He also kind of summed it up by saying, number one fan. Your fan yeah. should not be your sidekick. <laughs> you can tell a lot about a woman by the contents of her purse, but maybe that's not what you had in mind. You don't know that. <laughs> he's just taking it too far. Hey, look. Oh, oh he's a stalker. The last a girl. Mr. Incredible. Oh, is he a romantic? Uh, no. <laughs> no, it's all right. I've got him. I just took him out for but you. But his attention was on me. A simple thank you will suffice. Oh, God, this version of floating. The lady got me first. Oh! Competitive floating. <laughs> I love that the guy fucking tries to chime in on it. Yeah. We could share, you know. I work alone. You need to be more flexible. You doing anything later? I have a previous engagement. Yes. She get it. Yeah. Okay. Whatever. It's part of the banter. It's part of the flirting. Mm -hmm. I did always think her powers were way cooler. Than his? Yeah. 
Personally. It's just whether you like elastic powers versus your basic, you know, oh, super yeah. strength and whatnot. And oh, yeah. Fair no. enough. It's just in my personal opinion, just for me. Hey, Frozo! Should you be getting ready? You got time! if I'd go for either, but if I had to pick one or the other, maybe stretching is actually, you know. You're practically indestructible. So is he. Yeah, yeah. in a different uh, way. Yeah. Uh, biggest mistake of his life. I think you broke something. I think you broke something. Yeah. Yeah. This movie demonizing the mentally ill. Oh, fucking of course. Oh, uh, yeah. Bomb voyage. Oh, uh, incredible! And Incrediboy! Oh, uh, no. No. Uh, yeah. Shit. I have these rocket boots. Go They're home, buddy. For... You always, always say, be true to yourself. I am your ward. Carried it too far, buddy. Oh! Kind of overstepping the boundaries. <laughs> Not every superhero has powers, you know. I invented these. Can you fly? Fly home, buddy. Yeah, there's also that. He just doesn't do team ups. <laughs> so I'll show yeah. you. I'll go get the police. Oh, buddy, go. Oh, oh, stop. Oh, oh, no. Yep. Didn't listen. Oh, oh, I'm, I can do this. Please. I do like just how well, without really saying anything, they emphasized how bad of an idea kids' sidekicks are. <laughs> yeah, yeah, totally. If the kids got superpowers and, like, with their kids later, That's one it's a little thing, different. It's like, oh, shit, they've literally got uh -huh. superpowers. You gotta treat them mm -hmm. how to use them, otherwise they're gonna mistreat them. But, uh, sure. this guy, not so much. <laughs> Agreed. Yeah, what he needs is therapy. Yeah, there's one thing this movie emphasizes, the importance of therapy and counseling. <laughs> Nice, good save. Damn, bro. You want to drop down or...? <laughs> the blast in that building was caused by Bomb Voyage. You might be able to nab him. You mean he got away? Skippy here made sure of that. Incredible! He saved you from blowing up, dude. Just shut up. <laughs> Holy smokes, I'm late. What about Bomb Voyage? We'll get him! Eventually! He's got a personal life. Uh, Is the night still young? <laughs> You're very late. It's unfortunate when it's like, can you really have a personal life? It's always the question. That's kind of the point of this movie. Yeah, and I guess as you see here, everyone at the fucking wedding's a superhero. Yeah, we I know. know. That's the only people they know. Yeah. I didn't realize you'd actually forgotten. I thought it was playful banter. It was. Obviously didn't forget. You need to be more flexible. Oh, that's clever. You gotta be more than Mr. Incredible. You know that. Don't you? I do. He does not. It's smooth. <laughs> as long as we both shall live, no matter what happened. We're superheroes. What could happen? Yes. Oi. All the things? Cancel culture. <laughs> Hero is being sued for saving someone didn't want to be saved. Foiled in his attempted suicide has filed suit. <sighs> And what a thing to file suit over. I saved your life! You didn't save my life, you ruined my death! It's such a weird point to sue over. Another suit was filed by the victims of the L train accident. Dozens of superhero lawsuits. Time for their secret identity only identity. It's just such a classic trope in all superhero stories, though. Yeah. They all gotta do it sooner or later. This movie just starts with it. It makes sense. They kind of blended a lot of the best tropes and elements of the superhero mythos. Oh, for sure. Because it's not about the tropes, it's just about the characters is in the story yeah exactly the tropes you know are just I mean? a vehicle yeah and i think that's important to note for like any story that like oh i've seen this trope before or this story it's like it's not really about exactly where the story ends up it, or like the exact part they're taking it's more like how the characters deal with that and how the movie executes telling that version of the story you know exactly. what i mean yeah yeah no the way i yeah. kind of see it is like okay yes you've had a cheeseburger before from yeah. this one yeah. place does that mean you're yeah. never gonna have a cheeseburger ever again in your life because well i've had a cheeseburger <laughs> you know yeah that's an interesting way to see it the government initiated the superhero relocation program where are they now they are living among us and anonymously continuing to make the world a better place sure <laughs> are they denied i have full coverage i'm sorry mrs hoganson uh. And it makes so much sense for him that he'd try to get into an industry where he helps people. Yeah, only to find out that he can't. Mm -hmm. We are now officially moved in. In the last three years, don't count. Finally unpacked the last box. Oh, three years? Moving is such That's a, a Three years of that? I gotta go pick up the kids from school. See you tonight. Where were we? If you can't help me, I don't know what I'll do. Here comes the moral conundrum. Uh -huh. <laughs> I'd like to help you. 
but I can't. <laughs> Take a copy of your policy to Norma Wilcoxon. That's so sweet. U-I-L-C-O-X on the third. It's really nice of him to go to the effort. I would not expect someone to get back to you quickly <laughs> to resolve the matter. What a champion. But there's nothing I can do. Ooh, take it. I know you're upset. Uh, <laughs> nothing I can do. Pretend to be upset. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, be cool, man. Be cool. Like, everybody has to leave upset. That's just standard practice. Yeah. You authorized payment on the Walker policy? Broke into their house. Their policy okay. clearly. Covered. Have you heard about the fucking beef with the character design for his boss? No, what? You know Lord Farquaad? Are these two guys both based on the same dude? No, no, no. Lord Farquaad okay. is based on someone who works at Pixar or Disney. And yeah, yeah, yeah. this guy is based on someone who works at DreamWorks. This was a retaliation to Lord Farquaad. Wait, so the, basically the guy who was Lord Farquaad is involved with, the, like, who they based Lord Farquaad on is, like, involved in this and wanted his personal revenge? Yeah, basically. They're just basically tossing insults at each other via these characters who they're depicting as small, angry little jerks. Okay, good time. <laughs> Fantastic. That's cinema. There's yeah, personal billion pettiness. Billion dollar companies. <laughs> you think <laughs> millions and millions worth of CGI and animation, all that just to be like, mm. man, screw you. <laughs> Don't tell me about their coverage. Tell me how you're keeping insurecare in the black. Oh, and of course, this is inconceivable. With you writing checks to every Harry Hardluck, I give you a phone call. Yeah, and no, I can hear that voice for sure. Yeah. I appreciate you coming down here, Mrs. Potts. <laughs> Little asshole. He puts thumbtacks on my stool. Saw him do this? Actually not. Yeah, the thumbtacks on the stool thing is never a good prank. No, that, that's, that's always up. taking it a bit far. Then how do you know it was him? I hit a camera. Yeah, and this time I've got him. Uh-huh. This poor man. <laughs> oh my god. You see? Yeah. Oh, you don't see it? That is messed up, dude. This kid is just gaslighting this man. <laughs> he moves right there! There, right as I'm sitting down. I don't know how much of an asshole he is or isn't, but like, god damn, this is rough. Bernie. This little rat is guilty. Yeah. <laughs> you and your son can go now, Mrs. Parr. He's guilty. Yeah, and he doesn't know, like, they don't have the ability to, like, slow down the footage, you know what I mean? No. Show it frame by frame or whatever, or at least he doesn't have the ability. This is the third time this year you've been sent to the office. Amateur hour. Only three times in one year. We need to find a better outlet. They'd let me go out for sports. You know why we can't do that. I'll only be the best by a tiny bit. The world just wants us to be like everybody else. Our powers made us special. Everyone's special, Dash. Another way of saying no one is. I like how that line comes up later. Uh, which one? Everyone's special, which is another way to say no one is. Fair. Comes up later. Hey, Ryder, where you headed? <laughs> Uh, I don't know if you saw the second one, but damn, did they change Tony's design a lot. I did see the second one one time, and I'll be honest, I don't really remember it. Yeah, like, I love tiny things, but that's, like, regular size, and he's just way too big for it. Yeah, that's just ill-fitting, unfortunately. Mm. Oh. <laughs> I did not want to just bent Dude. him out of place. If you just bent it back into place a little bit. Right? <laughs> don't crush the child. <laughs> hey, man. You What's can't up? prove anything. <laughs> Come on, buddy. You can do it. I don't think he wants to. <laughs> You're making weird faces again. Mm, well, I'm not. You make weird faces, honey. <laughs> Dash got sent to the office again. Good. Good. Bob, that's bad. What? <laughs> Buddy. Dash got sent to the office again. What? I love how he thought he was going to be able to get away with that one. Yeah. Totally. Good attempt, man. Good attack on the teacher's chair. Barely see it on the tape. And you still got away with it? Whoa. <laughs> Dude. Time and this place. This goddamn idiot. How fast do you think you were Bob, going? we are not encouraging this. <laughs> Honey. <laughs> Yeah, you are very much encouraging. First the car. What happened to the car? <laughs> so this kid? <laughs> that fucking face. Just hold it back for later, bro. How's school? I'm not hungry for meatloaf. What are you hungry for? Tony Ridinger. Hot. Shut up, you little insect. Tell she is. Honey? Kids, listen to your mother. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> She'd eat if we were having Tony Loaf. Tony Loaf. Jesus Christ. Uh, I don't like the thought. You're gonna grind Tony up into meatloaf? Yes. <laughs> That's sick, man. 
twist. Yeah, it's plot twist. You thought it was romantic. She's actually a cannibal. <laughs> Just yeah. one of my favorite details about the movie that I found out after the fact. The director said that they mm. based the powers of each family member on like a kind of like archetypal element of their role in the family. Bob's a dad mm. who are expected to be like super yeah, strong, strong, carry everything. Sure. Mom is flexible and is able to like yeah, juggle so, so many things at once just. dash is a kid so he's got unlimited energy violet's a teenager so she disappears and she puts up barriers between people and jack jack's mm. a baby so he has unlimited potential yeah that makes perfect sense cool mm -hmm. right <laughs> advocate of superhero rights missing ah! it's your time to get back in the game yeah i need you to intervene okay I'm <laughs> I'm jesus christ your brother um, shush, 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 we're normal, we're normal. What the hell? Sushi! Hey, Speedo! Ice of you to drop by! Never heard that one before. Yeah, bro, come on. Hilarious, bro. Whoa! <laughs> Oh, I like it when it chatters. <laughs> he craves destruction. He does. Where are you two going? It's Wednesday. <laughs> Bowling night. Ducking out right in the middle of dinner. Come on, man. Mm -hmm. Don't think you've avoided talking about your trip to the principal's office. I'm not the only kid who's been sent to the office. Other kids don't have superpowers. Yeah, other kids are trying to gaslight their teachers into believing that the attack is just appearing yeah. out of nowhere. And having your parents have to play along with it for the sake of their fucking security and you know, anonymity. <laughs> I managed to find cover in what does Baron Von Ruthless do? He's swapping back in the day stories. Oh yes, very much in the back in the day mode. Lucius less so, Bob definitely mm. more so. Oh yeah. We have 2356. 2356, what is that? Yeah, glad he knows it. You wanna catch a robber? No. What if we actually did what our <laughs> wives think we're doing? <laughs> How crazy would that be? Whoa, let's get wild, let's get crazy, bro. I just talking what are we doing here bob we're protecting people nobody asked <laughs> you need an invitation i like one <laughs> like an invitation yeah oh my god how is that gonna work out it's got a watermark <laughs> it was fun the first time but if we keep doing it a fire. Yeah, see, uh, it's helping yeah. people, but there's also why you're doing it. I know, because it's been so long, all you can think about is like, yes, back in the action. Yeah. You're like, Not yeah, the... but why are you back in the action? Yeah. It's great to help. Don't get me wrong, it's great that they're mm. helping, but it's the motivation. Mm. Can't you put this out? I can't lay down a layer thick enough. They're also apparently pretty out of practice. Yeah. This hot and I'm dehydrated. I thought you can use the water in the air. There is no water in this air. Run out of muscle. I can't just go smash it through walls. The building's getting weak. I'm gonna come down on top of it. I'm pretty sure if you <laughs> smash through the outer walls, the building will collapse behind you, though. Yeah, if you're you know? fast enough. I know he doesn't have super speed, but I think he's fast enough to just run through the wall and keep running. Yeah, there you go. Like that. Hey. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Oh, this is so great. That was somewhat okay work, boys. Oh, oh no. <laughs> that looks so bad. God damn it. <laughs> Incompetent bad guys! Freeze! <laughs> Incompetent bad guys. Yeah. Freeze! I'm just getting a drink of water, man. Just getting a drink. Not dehydrated anymore. I want I you know. to freeze. Police officers! See, that guy's dead. <laughs> That's always the funny thing in cartoons and shit. They make it look like you can survive being frozen alive like that. We are not doing that again. You want to switch targets? This is the one he's been looking for. It's interesting that we're going off to Lucius. Yeah, no, I did always wonder about that ice power thing. It's never depicted as deadly, and it's like, no. It's ice. That shit will kill you. Yeah, it's freezing all the blood in your body. <laughs> not to mention you can't mm. breathe. So it's not like anyone has cryogenic ice powers, you know what I mean? They never yeah. mention them. They're special. I'm back. Yeah. Is this rubble? She's no rookie. Just a little workout. You know how I feel about that. We can't blow cover again. The building was coming down anyway. How many times have they blown cover, right? Yeah, for three years of moving. Mm-hmm. Suggests things. You knocked down a building? It was on fire. I performed a public service. You act like that's a bad thing. It is uprooting our family so you can relive the glory days. Yeah is better than acting like they didn't happen. Yes, they happened. Our family is what's happening now. Yeah, she's not acting like it didn't happen, though, you know? Oh, yeah, no. You are missing this. She's not devaluing it. She's recognizing the impact it has. You don't want to go to your son's graduation. She is moving from the fourth grade to the fifth grade. They keep creating ways to celebrate mediocrity. If someone is genuinely exceptional, This is not they... about you. Yeah, projecting a bit. Yeah. Want to do something for Dash? Let him go out for sport. It's not about you! I know you're listening. Obviously. 
Yeah. The wise to your shit. Come on out. We're just having a discussion. Pretty loud. What's important is that mommy and I are always united. <clears throat> well, I don't know about united. Against the forces of... Pig-headedness? <laughs> united against the forces of pig-headedness. Everything's okay. Go back to bed. Well, that is how you should be seeing it. It's you and your partner against the problem. We should all be in bed. Well, it should be how you're seeing it, but that's not how they're actually behaving oh. right now. Oh, I know. Just for what they told their kids happened. It should be sure. that. It should be. It's not what they yeah, were doing. Yeah, unfortunately, it ends up just being do as I say, not as I do, and they don't actually learn. Yeah, they've got to actually follow up. Mr. Huff would like to talk to you in his office. I do have to point out, though, as much as I can agree with Helen's desire for responsibility and not being reckless and having stability, she's also ignoring the fact that his soul is slowly withering out of his body. Yeah, when there's a direct discussion about it, oh, it's just a little workout. Not a big deal. I don't have to talk about my feelings or anything. The root of the problem is not getting addressed. This guy needs to be productive. This insurance thing, this ain't happening. So this idea that he can just keep doing things exactly the way they are and everything's going to be fine. It's not going to work out. Oh, hell no. I really honestly don't think he has anything that he needs to talk about. I think he needs to be productive. Because the reality Hold here on. is his problem is that the thing that is killing him is that he can't be useful to the public anymore. He's not a hero. You don't need to talk about that. You need to be useful. Yeah, yeah. Okay, well, yeah, I just wanted you to clarify what you meant by productive. It's productive for him specifically. It's about what he thinks, and he no, thinks no. that he's being useless to society. No, that's exactly so what I'm saying. So he needs to feel like he's... Yeah, I know, but yeah. Ooh. Sit down, Bob. So happy. I'm not happy, Bob. Like, are you ever happy, Dude, though? are you ever happy? Yeah, right. right. Your customers make me unhappy. Inexplicable <laughs> knowledge of insurer cares in our working. It's like they're informed or something. Exploiting mm. every loophole, dodging every obstacle. <laughs> Did I do something illegal? No. You saying we shouldn't help our customers? <sighs> Jesus. Not directly saying that. <laughs> <laughs> We're supposed to help people. We're supposed to help our people. They're stockholders, Bob. Oh, the poor stockholders. Will someone yeah. think of the stockholders? A company is like an enormous club. Enormous club. Yes, precisely. Only works all the little cogs mesh. So you go be a good little cog. You know what I mean by cooperative cogs? Look at me when I'm talking to you. He Ask is him. getting mugged. Let's hope we don't cover him. I'll be right back. Oof. Stop right now or you're fired. Yeah, that's such a tough position to be in when you have oh. a family to take care of. Oh, I know. Get over here. Yeah. Oh. I'm not happy, Bob. No. I'd love to know the backstory from Mr. Incredible. Yeah, that. He got away. Good thing, too. I gotta say, when I was in the cinema the first time, when he said, good thing, too, the whole hmm. audience you hear go, ooh. <laughs> <laughs> but it's close to losing your... Oh, yeah. Oh, that guy's dead. Uh, yeah, right? <laughs> Sam <laughs> yeah. Walls, he's dead. Oh, yeah. Uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and that's uh, your life ruined, unfortunately. I'm fired. Yeah. Right. Oh, you think? But someone was in trouble. Someone's always in trouble. Yeah, see, this is the thing. He can't fit into this. It's just not going to work. No, precisely. Every time you say those words, it means a month and a half of trouble for me, Bob. Money, 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 money. Honestly, Whoop. he'd probably be better off in something like, like construction where he doesn't have yeah. to like, actively make people unhappy. <laughs> right? <laughs> Well, what are you waiting for? He wants you to pick up the car. Do it, do it! <laughs> <laughs> Something amazing, I guess. Me too, kid. Every time he comes back with, like, one more friend. <laughs> yeah. Do uh. you know how hard it is to rip a book in half? Uh, I can't even imagine. <laughs> what the fuck? Secret a tablet? message. <laughs> Yeah, he's like, what the fuck is this? Match, Mr. Incredible. Oh. Well, it's a good thing that screen's better than the standard uh, iPhone or tablet screen. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. iPad. <laughs> That'd have been fucked. <laughs> yes, we know who you are. Your secret is safe with us. My name is Mirage. That's an annoying screen. That'll just give me a headache. I represent a top secret division of the government. Something has happened at a remote testing facility. Money, dinner's ready. Okay. It threatens to cause incalculable damage. It's so interesting that we never saw Mirage's powers. I mean, I can imagine what they are, but that they mm -hmm. never used it in any way. It's a TV, trying to watch. Stop crying. It's time for dinner. One minute. 
payment will be triple your current annual salary. Obviously, that would be super useful. Yeah, I like that it wasn't just an ego trip for him. It literally was like he just lost his fucking job. <laughs> he needs money. You can still do great things. You have 24 hours to respond. Uh, dreaming of better days, huh? Feels like he can be relevant again. Like he can be needed again. I'm not saying it's wrong that he has this like mural to his past achievements. I just don't know if it'd be super healthy for him to be looking at it every day after coming home from his depressing as shit job. This message will self-destruct. <laughs> yeah, like I definitely can understand having memorabilia, but uh, as you say, just going there and checking on it all the time. Yeah, that's it's, like, that, it's in his office. Or that's whatever. his office. That's his little private yeah. study, man. I know you miss being a hero, and job is frustrating, and how much it means to me that you stay at it anyway. <laughs> oh shit! About the job. What? You are helping people. Your family. <laughs> the company is sending me to a conference. A conference. But I guess he feels like, oh, my family's fine. Yeah, yeah, right? <laughs> and I'm just going to be gone for a few days. I've never sent you to a conference. This is good, isn't it? Yeah. Finally recognizing your talent. Totally. That's what's happening. Oh, yeah. In too deep now. Oh, this is wonderful. Yes, it is. It's the way, yeah, he kind of like convinced himself all the superheroing on the side. It's fine. What? What? It's nothing. We'll be fine. This is Mr. Incredible. I'm in. That cognitive mm -hmm. dissonance is real, man. <laughs> the Omnidroid 9000, artificial intelligence enables it to solve any- It got smart enough to wonder why it had to take orders. We lost control. You want me to shut it down without destroying it? I love if the rest of this movie was just him fucking running around the island trying to figure this shit out. This yeah. is a wild goose chase. <laughs> Oh god. Oh god. Yeah. Yeah. yeah that <laughs> hey, he's been out of the game for a bit. It's a learning robot. Only increases its knowledge of how to beat you. This is very, very standard for someone who was essentially an elite athlete and then retired. Turn it down, do it quickly, don't destroy it. Don't die. Because you still eat the same amount of food, but you yeah. don't do the same amount of stuff. And then went straight to a yeah. desk job, of all things, yeah. especially. Yeah, just a wildly different lifestyle, but I guarantee he still eats more or less the exact same. Probably. You know? Big fella. He's <laughs> still stuck. Of course they are still. <laughs> yeah, okay. Showtime. It would yeah. be really useful if they'd just given him something to ride on. I know, like right? Like a hovercraft or <laughs> just, something. Just run around the fucking jungle for, for several hours. <laughs> yeah, it's poor yeah. bastard. Is there any, any tools to, you know, help him here? Done no significant exercise for the last 15 years, and now he's just getting the cardio of his life. And his expertise here is just being the strong guy. <laughs> Pretty much. Or like his special ability. Like, it's not in tracking things. This is not as fair as we've been shown. <laughs> but no, I do love the like James Bond-esque sort of style they gave everything in here. It's like, it's really cool. If as you're saying, in this whole period is set in like the mid 60s or whatever, it yeah. makes sense. <laughs> here you go, buddy. Get him, Didn't think it'd be that easy, huh? Of course, it can't be too easy because then he'll know what's up, right? <laughs> a fucking robot and I'll throw a fucking rock at it. <laughs> uh, Didn't he consider for a minute that like he might actually die and what would happen is to his family afterwards? <laughs> that happened. He did not think about that now. Hey, yeah, good for you. <laughs> oh. 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 Yeah. Yeah. Should have stretched for that. That does bro. make sense. Cool. Yeah. Yeah, he don't stretch like that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I do, do appreciate he's just sitting there. Easiest six figure salary I ever made. <laughs> nice. Now let's just leave all this trash here and go collect our money. Someone else will clean it up. <laughs> God damn it. So this this bit always confused me a little bit. If that's actual lava, you wouldn't be able to stand there. The heat would be It's gonna just be you. an effect. <laughs> you, you, you'd assume they're using an effect. Just because yeah. they're in a lava, like a volcano, they're like, yeah, we gotta go with the aesthetic. Yeah, sure, but I'm like, what is it then? <laughs> what is pouring out of the ceiling right now? <laughs> I take it our host prefers a certain amount of anonymity. Of all the places to settle down, why live- With a volcano, 
He's attracted to power. Which is also funny, we consider uh, that, like, they know who he is. He's still wearing the fucking domino mask. I know. He's gonna cling to his old ideals. He's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. You don't know, though. Yeah. <laughs> we know you know. He's just slightly delusional. <laughs> yeah, he's literally just gaslighting himself. Like, nah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Amazing what a change in a work environment can do for you. But yeah, now he feels useful again, regardless yeah. of the fact that he's doing absolutely nothing. Honestly, he's yeah. just playing, he's kind actually, of just that's playing a really with good toys. point. He's not actually. <laughs> helping anyone, anyone. like in the, in the community in the city or anything but like that he doesn't know that company. he just thinks but he thinks kill a robot like obviously that now it won't attack anyone else later right yeah I guess the good thing is at least he's um, getting back training, getting himself ready for whatever fights come his way. That's smart. That would be smart. For his sake and his family's yeah. sake. But I appreciate that point. I never fucking realized it before. Just how much the job is really just him satisfying his own ego to an extent like just yeah, feeling yeah. useful yeah, yeah. but not actually doing and anything like, of good for on a grander scale you know but that's true for most people it's just a matter of how much good you actually end up doing and how useful you end up being it doesn't matter what your reasons are to a degree if you actually do the good things put your ego out there stroke that ego <laughs> oh sure as, <laughs> yeah. as long as you can channel it towards something good by all means I don't, exactly I don't care. What I mean. <laughs> exactly whatever your process is if you end up doing good things then cool yeah for sure but no, it's just funny how like when he was saving the people from the burning building before he was doing objectively more good than he was through this, but he feels more accomplished doing this, you know? <laughs> I know. No, it's all about perception. What is it? Who are you? What do you want? Mm -hmm. Fuck me dead, I love Edna Mode. Yes, things are going quite well, no complaints. But I used to design for gods. Well, no. Is that what you're really going to call this guy right here? Some of them weren't even particularly powerful, right? Yeah. I was surprised to get your call. I just need a pass job. Moonlighting hero work? Why is your shit? This is a hobo suit, darling. You can't be seen in there. <laughs> hobo suit. Jesus. The last thing that she made him. Yeah. I never looked back. But where the heck am I going to get a new you suit? You can't! It's impossible! You want to make me a suit? You push too hard, darling. But I accept. Yeah. She's just been waiting <laughs> yeah. for this shit. Something classic. Like Dinah Guy. Oh, the cape and the boots. No capes. Hey, cape's a bad idea. Yes, generally speaking. Thunderhead. Although I wonder if it's as much of an issue for a character who doesn't fly. I mean, it could get tripped up and caught on things. His cape snagged on a missile <laughs> thing. The guys from Watchmen got killed because of his cape getting stuck in a revolving door. Stratogale. <laughs> cape caught in a jet turbine. <laughs> Dino guy, snag on tape. Off. I do appreciate while we're going through this montage of why you shouldn't have a cape. It <laughs> reminds me of um, the brief time Booster Gold had a cape. Ah. And like, it looks pretty cool, and he loved it. And then Superman came along and just ripped off. I was like, yeah, cape's not for you, man. <laughs> what? <laughs> I can't remember the exact context. They're like, I, they might have done a mission together or something, but Superman was just like, nah, you don't go with the cape, man. You, not for you, buddy. <laughs> not for you. Not for you. No capes! We'll be finished before your next assignment. But he doesn't get to have any input on the design? No. Only need a patch. Fucking designers, man. <laughs> Fine. I will also fix the hobo suit. Jesus. <laughs> You're the best of the best, Yes, e. I know. <laughs> I don't know, what I've heard of commission work? Yeah, it kind of mm -hmm. is just like a, I just make the thing, mm -hmm. yeah? Okay. <laughs> yeah. You don't get me to redo it 12 times because you can't fucking explain what you want. We have a new assignment for you. How soon can you get here? I'll leave tomorrow morning. Hey, honey. Who was that, honey? Another conference. Duty calls. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Duty calls. <laughs> Fucking Mr. Big Success now. I know. He go, looks like a dude who's having an affair. I know, right? Have a great trip. Thanks, sweetie. I love you so much. I love you too. Yeah, honestly, this to me is what really solidifies that. Like, this is a family movie. This isn't a movie oh, yeah. for kids. It's just accessible mm. to children. Yes, yes. But it's a family movie. Oh, yeah. There weren't many kids who were understanding what was happening there. Mm. What was the song? Not many. Oh, I was one of them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not many, if any. Fasten your seatbelt. We are beginning our. Descent. Should he not have had the seatbelt on like the whole time? Um, flights, it's just takeoff and landing most of the time. Yeah, but most planes are much larger and they don't move around so much. Just a small plane. 
point. I've never been on a private jet, so I wouldn't know. Well, smaller planes are more easily buffeted by winds and stuff. You're gonna you get think, knocked around right? a bit. Yeah. Right. That's it. Not to say that it's unsafe to fly without a seatbelt in a smaller plane or anything like that. It's, it's just gonna be a little bumpy. Even though I think the egg is silly, I fucking love that. <laughs> It'd be a really nice little trip right you know, through the jungle Very or whatever. scenic. Yeah. yeah. Eggs, the way of the future. <laughs> You'll be briefed on your next assignment in the conference room. Got it. See you there. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, man. Uh, the glamour of being a full time stay at home mom. Uh huh. I'd like to speak to Edna, please. <laughs> This is Helen. Helen who? Elastigirl. Darling! <laughs> <laughs> There's only one person Bob would trust to patch a super suit. I bet you Edna knew too. She was just like, I don't accept any other version. Yeah. <laughs> yes, yes. Much better than those horrible pajamas he used to wear. It's like the Bruce Wayne calls himself Batman in his head kind of thing. She doesn't recognize yeah. any of their civilian names. I'll finish. I know you're coming to see. Call don't make me beg. No. <laughs> <laughs> I'm calling about Bob's suit. You come in one hour, okay? Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> There's toxic uh, positivity in the best way. <laughs> yeah, as much as that's funny, I, man, I don't deal with people like just ignoring me like that. God, yeah, I can't stand it. It's only funny in a movie. <laughs> yeah. This fucker with the oh big gas on his table. Fuck Jeez. yeah, the fucking syndrome table, I was just about to say. <laughs> Surprise. Uh. <laughs> it's better. Too much for Mr. Incredible. Oh, uh, yeah, he would have been dead. Dead, dead. Oh, wow. It's finally ready! I went through quite a few supers to get it worthy to fight you. It wasn't good enough! Oh, you fool. God, Syndrome is such a good villain. I had to make some major modifications. It was difficult, but I am your biggest fan, buddy. Oh, he just realizes it now. Uh, My name is not Buddy! And it's not Incrediboy either! Hold up, was your name not Buddy, though? <laughs> I only wanted to help! What did you say to me? It was never Buddy. He was actually just getting it wrong the whole time. <laughs> I work alone. It tore me apart. I had to pause it just for that moment mm -hmm. there because it's so important to think when it was the scene was playing before, he was holding Bon Voyage. He wasn't really paying attention to Buddy. In Buddy's mind, he rejects him to his Face. Yeah, I know. So you're yeah, pointing out like the difference in perspective. Such a good For detail. Sure. And that's, it is a really good detail because this is definitely the kind of thing that happens all the time. Oh like, yeah. It happens to me. I'll just be sort of focused. There are things I maybe won't notice sometimes and people will be hurt. And I'm like, mm. oh no, no, no. I wasn't trying to ignore you. Yeah. I'm sorry. I was just in my own head. You know? It wasn't personal. But yeah, I totally. like how it speaks to Buddy's narcissism that he's constantly putting himself at the center of every narrative. He's yeah, the it's all about him. It, it wasn't. Mm -hmm. It was never about you. I learned an important lesson. You can't count on your heroes. Well, what were you counting on him for, though? Yeah. You know? I'm sorry. Now you respect me because I'm a threat. Turns out there are a lot of people who want respect, and they will pay to get it. Oh, trying to get that respect as a small child? Like, dude, <laughs> yeah. It takes time. I invented weapons. Now I have a weapon that only I can defeat. When I unleash it, I'll get... <laughs> <laughs> Tree! Oh. It's cool, huh? <laughs> nice. Okay, it is pretty cool. I'll give him that. Totally. Am I good enough now? <laughs> I'm Syndrome! Your nemesis in it! Oi. Brilliant. Yeah, not nemesis. <laughs> and it was just never about being good enough. I'll try this one on for size. Talk about eccentric billionaires. Yeah. Oh, God. Yeah. yeah. Is that, um, what's the name of this guy? Gazer Beam. <laughs> this is clever. How many other skeletons are in there? <laughs> yeah. Following the fucking eyesight. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Kronos? Yeah, Kaiser Beam's corpse is still where we left it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Mr. Incredible terminated. 
such a punch wouldn't you want to find yeah wouldn't you want to find Mr. Incredible's corpse and determine that the life signs weren't there never of course not he's a <laughs> super villain remember yeah, he's gonna fuck up sooner or later hey guys so we had some internet problems uh, which interrupted our connection so we had to stop recording halfway through but in that interim I started testing negative for spicy cough uh, so I was able to come over after all because now we're all good yeah yay Let's get back into it deeply confiscated my life darling my best work I must admit love that she's so passionate oh yeah I love the angle of a fucking animal in tour inspired fashion designer but who just a superhero nerd. Mm -hmm. I, just, I did Robert so I had to continue. I have no idea what you're talking about. That is why I show you my work. That's not what she was saying, but sure. Yeah, sure, let's go with that. <laughs> Edna mode. I'm guessing. Speaking of reliance on yeah. toys, though, I kind of love the parallel that Edna probably made all this mm. shit, that she's kind of like Syndrome in that sense, but she chose to help superheroes rather than trying to just become one, you know, herself, steal the spotlight. Fair. Cream and sugar. Chair's just way too short for her. Started <laughs> with the baby. Started? <laughs> the baby? You gotta start with the baby. <laughs> no! <laughs> would stand the temperature of over 1,000 degrees. <laughs> Plus side, that would be great for your child one way or the other. Sure. It's great for the clothes. Uh, ideally, you wouldn't be in that situation. Obviously. Machine washable, darling. That's a new feature. The machine washable part's nice. Yeah. Mm, luck favors the prepared. I like that sentence. Mm. Luck favors the prepared. Yes, Batman likes it too. Mm. Boy, suit I designed to withstand an enormous friction. Yeah, a necessary feature for this oh, yes. Material that will disappear completely as she does. Very necessary. This fucking world. <laughs> Your sword can stretch as far as you can. You think this would probably be the easiest one? Virtually indestructible. Sure, the indestructibleness, but they're all indestructible, right? Yeah, I guess so. Each suit contains a homing device. Oh, parents' wet dream. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe not wet dream. It's yeah, you know what? Parents' big dream. A parents' dream. Yeah. Bye. Is retired. You helped my husband resume secret hero work behind my back? I assumed you knew, darling. <laughs> sure. I don't think you did. No, it, fucking, you shit stir her, Edna. <laughs> she just loves the gossip. Men at Robert's age are often unstable. Do you know where he is? Of course. Do you know where he is? I'd say men of Robert's age and position mm -hmm. are prone to that kind of weakness. Sure. So yeah, if you're emotionally stable, kind of like, you know, well-rounded person, mm -hmm. probably not gonna fall into those kind of insecurities. Yeah, it's hard to go through a midlife crisis if you have no crisis to go through in midlife. Precisely. <laughs> and it is so sad in retrospect, just thinking of how many people's midlife crisis is just, I'm rediscovering the things I actually like. Yeah. I wish I had done all of these things. Yeah. Yeah. Sad. Every time I watch this sequence, I was like, secret agent man, secret <laughs> agent man. Yeah, see, I can't hear that song without hearing secret Asian man. Uh, yeah. So, <laughs> Is that you? Yes. <laughs> I, well, I related. So. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Ah, uh, yeah, I'm sure you're being super stealthy, buddy. <laughs> yeah, in your bright red suit. <laughs> that guy's dead. Yeah, he's, he's, okay. he's real dead. Yeah, if the, if the rock didn't kill him, the fall did. Mm. <laughs> Paralyzed at least. He's got, a, he's got a caved in skull and a broken neck. Oh, yeah. Somehow survives. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Barely. Oh, my God, they just show him later. <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh man. It's, it's getting dark. <laughs> ah, I found central egg hub. Yeah. <laughs> You know what to do. Just run straight through the lava. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, sure. Create a bridge. Whatever. <laughs> Something boring like that. <laughs> Use fucking forethought or some shit. Yeah. Christ. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Uh-huh. Go son, go son, go son, go son, go son, go son. Ooh, run harder. Be more like Dash. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Again, though, if it was real lava, I swear, he would have been cooked. Oh, yeah. He'd come out the other side of that medium rare. Yeah. He just comes out with, like, a fully obvious spray tan. <laughs> Orange, <laughs> fucking the Donald Trump special. Yeah. <laughs> Good guess. Yeah. <laughs> what? A, B, C, one, two, three. Bob Hart is my husband. He'd give me the number of the hotel he's staying in. I wonder how Gazer Beam got the password, though. Yeah. My records say his employment was terminated almost two months ago. <laughs> yeah. Been a while. 
since I was employed. <laughs> <laughs> since I knew what a job was. <laughs> Such a good scene. Yeah. This is so fucked. Yeah. There's an interesting parallel somebody made to the superheroes in this and superheroes in general, but in this specifically and how they all got wiped out mm. and the AIDS epidemic with the mm. queer community. How the oh. whole niche community uh, just got decimated yeah, by this, specifically. this one thing, you know, uh, specifically. They're all kind of in hiding. And obviously there's heaps of parallels between right. the superhero mythos and just queerness in general. Right. Like the hidden identity stuff. But in real life, it's like the government and society society and then yeah. this movie is just this weird ginger there's one yes <laughs> it's one asshole but who is kind of a stand-in in a way yeah, yeah, totally. for, totally. you know like a it's very typical like entitled straight white guy who thinks okay. he should yeah. be at the center of the narrative sure and uh yeah just the way that all these people were at their wedding mm. and now they're all gone mm -hmm. you know and mm -hmm. even in the sequel they touch on how few supers there are left and how they're finally coming back out they're finally allowed to be in public again mm. It's just a very interesting parallel. Sure. I'm not even sure if it was deliberate, but it's really cool. Sure, sure. Yeah, this is a, definitely a brutal list. Oh, yeah. So you don't know where he is. <laughs> this bitch. <laughs> yeah. Would you like to find out? I love her so much, but damn, she's just stirring away. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I want to check that one. Yeah, they know. <laughs> Yeah. Uh-huh. And I guess plus side is Syndra really does think he's been terminated. Yes. Yeah. I wanted to be a big hero again. Yeah. Whoops. <laughs> Ooh. Just the worst timing. <laughs> Real unfortunate. Oh, yeah. I love the creativity of the weapons, too. Like, these could have all just been guns. Absolutely. But this is almost better. Yeah. And I mean, I feel like the fact that it's a family movie, they kind of felt like they had to be creative with it. But it works. Well, if anything, a lot of instances in family content, mm. they come up with stuff that's better than death a lot of the times as a <laughs> consequence. <laughs> Better than death. Yeah. <laughs> For a uh, story impact, of course. I let this happen, you know. <laughs> the toilet roll nice man you're not good enough for my tissues and no. you know she has lots of boxes of tissues yeah. <laughs> this is not what she signed up for no you are Alaska girl pull oh, yourself yeah, together yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you will show him you remember that he is Mr. Incredible I'll remind him who you are uh, I love that she's just so invested yeah. in their laughing personas <laughs> Everyone needs a friend like Edna. Yes! Go! Confront the problem! Fight! Make sure Dash does his homework, get to bed on time. Sure. All of those things is gonna happen. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. I should be back tonight. Why am I in charge again? So the oldest person here. Why would you take the kids' suits? Yeah, it's a weird one. Hey, what's that? Where'd you get that mug? Ooh. <laughs> Yeah, that's rough. A little awesome. <laughs> yeah, that would be a real pain to deal with. Mm. Hey, Snog. What are these? Look, I'm the Dash. The Dash? Take that off before somebody sees you. Yeah, there's a few weird instances of superheroes just picking their fucking first names mm -hmm. <laughs> or surnames. Yeah. Your name is Dash. This is yours. <laughs> You're not coming. And I'm gonna run. Uh, might be a bit late for that one, dude. Mm -hmm. What makes you think it's special? Why'd mom try to hide it? Yeah, that's a good point. Yep. He's not an idiot. Yeah. He's a little dickhead. Yes, <laughs> very much. <laughs> I guess that'd be funny because it's like, she's never been able to be totally invisible yeah. before. She's never really been able to fully use her invisibility like that. Mm -hmm. What do you got that's fast? Interesting part. Mm. In the drafts of this, mm. her friend, the pilot guy, he was supposed to be the one flying the plane and he was going to die in this sequence uh, as a like- a bit, much, a bit too much? Yeah. yeah. It was supposed to be a like, no, the bad guys mean business kind of moment. Mm -hmm. Requesting vectors to the initial, over. Hmm. It's funny, I've been thinking throughout this movie, I really thought the Incredibles animation was much nicer looking than this, huh. but it just shows how much things change over time. Oh yeah. Fine, they're just all getting coffee. It's, you know what I mean? it's still fucking oh, really it's good. It's amazing. It especially holds up considering, yeah. but uh, yeah, it's just crazy how much better it's gotten even still. Exactly. This was considered revolutionary at the time. I mean, especially in the last few years you with the um, more art style. Oh yeah, oh yeah, the blended 3D, 2D. Oh fucking, yeah. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Spider-Verse. Yes.
Thank you, Klaus, in spite of us. Yeah, 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 yeah. Tricking the pro, hiding under the bones of another super? I'm still geeking out about it. I do love how he's such a dweeb. Yeah. I mean, Mr. Incredible calling for help? Lame, lame, lame. Who did you contact? Contact. Oh. Yeah, torture doesn't really work for information extraction. Yeah, but you know, he hasn't learned that yet. Mm, yeah, I true. Guess. You sent out a homing signal. I didn't know about the homing device. He also hasn't learned that that hairstyle really not working. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Who does he think he is? Vegeta? Yeah. <laughs> Checking in the yeah, I'll send them a little greeting. Ow! Violet! Dash ran away and I knew I'd get blamed for it and yes, I thought yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He is true. Classic. You left Jack Jack alone? No. Yeah. So he's here. Thanks a lot. All right. Who'd you get? You don't have to worry about one single thing, Mrs. Fry. Oh, right. Oh, yeah. yeah. The babysitter. Yeah. There's a whole uh -huh. short thing. Mm -hmm. I've actually never watched it. The Jack Jack Attack huh. little short movie thing. I take in courses and learn CPR. I also brought Mozart to play while he sleeps. Mozart <laughs> makes baby smart, but I'd really rather call a service. It is shown to be a very, very great thing to show. Expose. They expose young children mm -hmm. to very complex music because yeah. it does help develop the language senses of their brain. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. I've, I've heard that too. Yeah. yeah, music is a language. Music is it a language. Com it combines maths and tone and yeah. all sorts of great that just basically trains your brain. <laughs> yeah, it uses a lot of different areas of your brain, so you get kids listening to complex music early on, and even learning a little bit of music early on, yeah, great for their development. Oh yeah, totally handle anything this baby can do. Uh, someone could have warned her. They didn't know. <laughs> Oh, that's right. He they develop. don't know. He develops uh -huh. his powers while she's babysitting him. Oh, yeah. Cool fucking thing. Indian Golf 909 are transmitting. <laughs> 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 sure. They did it. Yep. Or not. Not fast enough. No. Nope. They tried to do it. That's what counts. Yeah. <laughs> Holy shit. Yeah. I'm kind of disappointed that nobody buffed in the plane. Yeah. Because, like, as if nobody buffed in the plane. Yeah, I can say as someone who was buffed many, many times on planes, especially on as a kid. Regular flights, yeah. I might add. Mm -hmm. Not spinny ones. Yeah. Bye! You have to put a force field around the plane. You weren't supposed to use our power. Yeah, yeah. You never gave her a chance to practice. That's the problem, yeah. <laughs> Again, it's an emergency situation. It's just do it or we die, but yeah. still. Abort, there are children aboard saying it. There are children aboard this. No! Yeah, that really, it really solidifies syndrome. It's just such a piece of shit. Yeah. Abort, abort, abort! Oh, that's right. Oof. Yeah. Yeah. Woo! Yeah, this is what I mean by I say I pick her powers because that's, that's uh, yeah. you have to be pretty indestructible to be able to get through that alive. Yeah. Period. Yep, sure. Very useful thing to have at this point. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and now she can, yeah, turn herself into a parachute. <laughs> yeah, it's very versatile, yeah. I suppose is the way to think of that. Right? Yeah. I definitely prefer this one over the second one, but I loved how the second one expanded on her powers. Sure. We're not gonna panic, we're not gonna look out! <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Well, I mean, that's worth panicking uh, over. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. This bit here where she was looking, it was supposed to be where the guy's hat would uh, float up. Uh -huh. And she'd realize he was dead. We're right. dead! Fun, but we're dead! Stop it! <laughs> we are not gonna die! Yeah, you guys can very easily get out of an ocean situation with the three of you. Well, to be fair, they have no idea how far away they are from land. Yes, but she can be a boat and he can be a motor. So sure. Yes. Target. Was destroyed. I seem to recall you prefer to work alone. Oh god. Yeah. So punchable. Yeah. That's my favorite kind of villain. Punchable villains, because you actually hate them. Yeah. Fair. Oh. Release me. Or what? I'll crush her. You wouldn't care even if he wasn't I bluffing. I know. <laughs> Show me. I think it's pretty clear he doesn't care one way or the other. Yeah. See, it's easy to call someone's bluff when you don't care if they're bluffing or not. Yeah. Even when you have nothing to lose, you're weak. And I've outgrown you. Yes, you were definitely punching up there, buddy. <laughs> Do you find it funny how like the henchmen of bad guys are always so shocked that they would be thrown aside by their like leader? I mean, they've seen their leader throw aside everybody else. So they're like, no, but I'm special. Uh, maybe not. Are you? Maybe not up until that point. And yeah, also just, yeah. yeah, it's kind of a testament to how like narcissistic personality types like yeah. that trick people into thinking, no, but you're different. You're special. You're yeah, special. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Borg, the people that tried to kill us? Land. Yeah. You expect us to swim there? I expect to trust me. Yeah, see. <laughs> 
this is a um, pretty good plan. Yeah. I'm, uh, but like, it's not crazy creative. She has been forming herself into all these things for a while. Mm. I wouldn't, you know, be that surprised if they were like, yeah, I didn't really ever see my mom turn into a boat. <laughs> sure. But when you know she has elastic powers, yeah. use her imagination. Uh, yeah. <laughs> There's not very creative kids. <laughs> These scenes are dark. Even in animated movies, they had mm. to go hard on the darkness and audio stuff. It fucking irritates yeah. me. I'm so proud of you. Thanks, Mom. Like, it's a movie. We need to see what's happening, not yep. feel like we're in it. I know. I don't think I'm a part of this world, man. I know, right? It's the fucking thing I heard. Where's the lighting coming from in this scene? Yeah. The same place as the music, buddy. <laughs> yeah. I think it's Stanley Kubrick. Yeah, that one, yeah, right? yeah. I think so. Your father is in trouble. We're not doing so hot either. I'm going to look for him. <laughs> That's great. Yeah. You're in charge until I get back, Violet. What? Oh, it kind of makes sense, man. I'm the youngest sibling. Mm -hmm. I get it. I'm pretty sure there's a bigger age gap between them two. Your identity yeah. is your most valuable possession. If anything goes wrong, your power. But you said never. I know what I said. Time and place. Come on, Burr. Remember the bad guys on those shows? I really appreciated this. Yeah. Well, these guys are not like those guys. They will kill you if they get the chance. Not give them that chance. Yeah. Good yeah. little speech. Easy to understand. Yeah. And very straightforward. Mom, what happened on the plane? I'm I'm sorry. It wasn't yeah. fair for me to suddenly ask so much of you. You have more power than you realize. The classic believing yourself part of the story. Yeah, but it's done well, you sure. know? It's... If the time comes, you'll know what to do. Handled well. I'm glad that she followed up on it. And it's like, yeah, the reasons for her demanding so much, even though she admitted it wasn't mm. fair, were very understandable. Oh, yeah. You can only do as much as you think you're capable yeah. and what you think is right at the time. Fucking Elon Musk. <laughs> Syndrome buys Twitter. <laughs> Renames it S. <laughs> <laughs> Valuing life is not weakness. Oh, hey, I had everything under control. So holding shit over people when you have all the power in a situation isn't strong. <laughs> yeah. I knew he wouldn't have it in him to actually... Next time, oh. bet your own life. Yeah. Eh, completely fair. Kind of appreciate how shocked he is. Yeah, it's like, what, what? the fuck? <laughs> You're not just gonna listen to my bullshit? <laughs> what, I can't gamble with your life? Yeah. <laughs> Why not? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say, get on top of that mm -hmm. pod. I've always really liked agile kind of powers, like Spider-Man and shit. Yeah, sure. Me too. Traversal, fun traversal kind of powers. <laughs> mm -hmm. All the reality is going fast on the ability to change directions and do things really quickly is mm. very useful. True. It'd just be tricky with all the like physics and shit involved. Sure. <laughs> well, that's not like you ever think of that. Oh, you just do things. Oh, you won't think of it until you've caved in someone's chest because you're just trying to push them at super speeds. <laughs> I'd like to think you'd be smart enough to know that's a bad idea. You'd think. <laughs> it seems really obvious, like a terrible plan. It does seem that way, but most people don't think of it at all when they're watching something like The Flash. You True, know? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, The Flash punches someone in the face at super speed and they're like, they're just unconscious. No. 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 Their fucking, their skull is powderized. God, it's <laughs> obliterated. Yeah. It is so funny how the context of that has changed so much yeah. <laughs> over the years. That's unfortunate, but at least it wouldn't hurt that much. Yeah. Also, can you not get your way out of it? Oh, it's really got a hold on you, huh? Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, that's unfortunate. Hey! Hey! What's up? <laughs> what the fuck am I looking at? <laughs> <laughs> Oops. <laughs> this is great. <laughs> <laughs> Like, dude, come on. I love how he just waited for that to happen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> nice. nice. Yeah. You know what? Plus sign, mm. childbirth for her would have been a breeze. Yeah, super easy. Barely an inconvenience. I'm gonna go look around. What do you think is going on? Maybe don't look around. Pretty sure your mom said stay here. Mom and dad's lives could be in jeopardy. Worse, their marriage. How is that worse, dude? Oh, man. Bad guys are trying to wreck marriage. Oh, forget Tell it. me you didn't come from a broken home. <laughs> so like, oh, worse, their marriage. Like, really? That's the worst thing you can think of? Your parents getting divorced? Please. Oh, oh yeah. Please. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, most definitely. Your parents <laughs> dying, one or both. Yeah, or you. Yeah, any of those things. Much worse than divorce. Yeah. Yeah. Well, settle down, suburban. <laughs> Mom said they hid me. I'm not gonna leave the cave. God, 
dumb smile on his face. I like know. everything's totally fine. Shit eating grin. <laughs> Moral. <laughs> I know, right. I know it's so typical of like a young boy and all that crap. Yeah, yeah. But like, god damn. Mm. It's like, it's totally fine. He's, he's a fine character. He's fine. He's funny. It's all good. But yeah, he is the second most punchable character in this mm. movie. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Just little idiot. Yeah. <laughs> he only gets away with it because he's a child. Yeah. What did you do? Well, I guess the plus side is he didn't actually do this. <laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> Just it's like, you went away for like two minutes. Yeah. What is wrong with you? <laughs> <laughs> and I guess also plus side, they can't say that they left the cave by yeah, choice. Yeah, true. They were true. forced out. Oh, exactly. Bob. Huh? What? Uh, I didn't see anything. <laughs> She's like, my name's not Bob. Yeah. I thought you knew that. Yeah, we've been working together for like 10 years. I thought we were close, man. <laughs> I was at your wedding. Yeah. <laughs> oh, shit. Identification, please. Hey, hey, Violet, come here, look. Oh, oh, yeah. Voice key, incorrect. My dude. I mean, they've got superpowers. It's not the most outlandish thing. <laughs> Wait a second. But yeah. But yeah, wouldn't you be like, hang on, that seems suspicious. Yeah. <laughs> Just a bit slow on the uptake, that's mm -hmm. all. Yeah, for such a fast kid, he's not particularly mentally um, skilled. Well, he's <laughs> fast in the physical sense alone. No, I know. Yeah, yeah. There isn't much time. No, there isn't. This is very dark. What more can you take away from me? Family survived the crash. They're alive? Yeah, it's usually best to get information from people before you stop their ability to talk. Oh, yeah. You really think in that moment, he probably would have killed her. <laughs> he would have. And then he wouldn't have found out that his family is actually alive. Yeah. <laughs> Whoops. You must be Mrs. Sinclair. <laughs> oh, God. Go, you lousy, lying, unfaithful creep. How could I betray the perfect man? But you did. Kind of. Not in the way she's thinking. Fair, fair. What? Security's been sent into the jungle. In all fairness, this woman did still help to murder a shit ton of people. This, this is true. Yeah, how did she justify that? Yeah. You gotta wonder. <laughs> yeah, do. You think they're supers? <laughs> you think they're supers? Run! What? Run! Oh, yeah. What the f Yeah, run. Bro, yeah. the one thing you do. <laughs> <laughs> Show yourself! Oh, they can ride those things. Yeah, yeah. Cool, but yeah, also... Really cool design. Yeah. I'd be really worried about getting the side blades caught on stuff as I was navigating around. Oh, for sure. Yeah, see? Bugs. Yeah. No one who does a super speed thing thinks of the bugs. They, nev <laughs> they never deal with that. That's true. You think a speedster of any kind would have a better mask. Yeah. Like a full face visor. Oh, yeah, for sure. You know what I'm saying? I mean, there have been a couple of uh, speedsters with face visors, but they weren't full face. Yeah, no, it's only like half. It's always... Like the eyes or something. Yeah, yeah. yeah some bullshit. <laughs> Stupid. You'd be smiling with bugs in your teeth for sure. Hey. Oh my god, Dash, yeah. did you just realize that you were quicker than this guy? Oh, well, he's never had the chance to explore his powers, so, so no. Which I really like that they worked that in there. If you've been super speedy your whole life and everyone else is super slow, you wouldn't stop to think, yeah, I'm obviously faster than everybody else. Yeah, no, I absolutely... You don't need experience fighting no, someone. No, I get what you're saying, I get what you're saying, but I'm glad that they take it as a moment. It's like, I can sus suspend my disbelief for that moment. I don't know, it's good. It's just written really well. I just like it. Okay. I just like how they work it in. I mean, I disagree, obviously. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> yeah. And that's how Dash took his first life. <laughs> yeah, does he know that? <laughs> I feel like he doesn't. Nah. Nah. That wasn't my fault. <laughs> yeah. Look at where he was going. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. That guy he definitely killed. Oh, yeah. Just totally fair. Up. They're trying to kill him, but yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm going to say three of those men are now dead. But I guess here's number four. Yeah. And five. Yeah. Yes. Okay. We're just racking up the body count. Yeah. <gasps> <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, now this I can understand not realizing until you're doing it. Yeah, yeah. Because it's like, how would you know that you could run fast enough to run on water? Yeah, yeah, fast enough, particularly. Yeah. That was uh, something that I even saw in like an interview that they were like, at first it was just he was going to deliberately go onto the water and there wasn't going to be anything to it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But the director or someone was like, no, 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 he should think he's going to fall in, uh, then realize. Yeah. These little moments, you know? Sure. I should have told you I was fired, but I didn't want you to worry. You don't want me to worry. <sighs> <laughs> Solid work, dude. Classic. Mm. And now we're running for our lives through some godforsaken jungle? I know you're there, little miss disappear. Ooh. Ooh. Nice. Yeah. Gotta double tap every time. If you're trying to take someone out, you gotta at least make sure they're unconscious. Mm -hmm. I gotta understand not wanting to kill him, but yeah, you know. 
There you are. Hey! Don't touch my sister! Huh? Went hard. <laughs> uh -huh. Nice. How are you doing that? I don't know. How is she hovering there? Yeah, I guess it suspends her. <laughs> I suppose it does. Yeah. And apparently, he, yeah, I love this that he can so run great. it like a hamster wheel. This is such a great team up. Or hamster ball, I should mm, say. Hamster yes. ball, yeah. But also consider, she said, I don't know how I did it. Oh, yeah, yeah. She was totally willing to take bullets for him. Ah. You're all right. We're so worried about you. I thought I'd never you. see you again. Oh, family moments. Yeah. Bonding over near-death experiences. Yeah. <laughs> Watching dad murder someone right before your eyes. Mm. Oh, I, I love, love you. you. Wow. It's real though, a surprising amount of people die in this. Yeah, I know, right? Yeah. But I think it's like some of the smartest superhero stories mm. will always have like indirect killing. Oh yeah. It's not like execute on the spot. No, but people die. Yeah. yeah. Time yeah. out! Matching uniforms? You married Elastigirl? And God? Busy! Why is that funny? Because it just contradicts his fan fiction ideas. I know, it's just so <laughs> weird, man. Like, oh, this is just too good. Such a dweeb. Yeah, he it's is. Great. Huge dweeb. It's like not that interesting. Yeah, they got married. Yeah. Good for them. Well, because you don't see them as people. <laughs> I know, yeah, totally. He sees them as characters. Yeah, yeah. The robot will emerge dramatically. And just when all hope is lost, Syndrome will save the day. All of it. Yeah, that is wildly delusional. And you killed off real heroes so that you could pretend to be one? Oh, I'm real. Yes. Yeah. No, exactly. And I did it without your precious powers. I'll give them the most spectacular heroics anyone's ever seen. And when I'm old and I've had my fun, sell my invention so that everyone can be super. This is the line I was talking about. Uh -huh. And when everyone's super, no one will be. Yeah. Yeah. That's a real sad little boy. Yeah. And he's only content to have other people be special or more special than him uh, once he's done. Oh yeah. When he's finished, yeah. he can either can allow it, but only to make sure no one else will ever be special afterwards. It's uh, such great character motivation. Sure. Like he's so fucking despicable, it's <laughs> but just, it's just well written. It's so good. Yeah. This is my fault. I've been a lousy father. It's not all your fault, but of course you have some responsibility. Yeah, glad he's taken accountability. Indeed. <laughs> and wow. Yeah. So caught up in the past that I... I just so easily figured that out. You are my greatest adventure. I'm gonna get us out of this safely. Well, it's time we wind down now. Yeah. yeah. I saw an aircraft hangar on my way in. <laughs> These assholes. Just having the greatest time. Yeah. But the Mirage, you can't be all like, oh no, what have I done now? <laughs> yeah. People died. <laughs> yeah. Every time they run, they take a shot. <laughs> 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 yeah, what a drinking game. Oh, uh, no, right? Good God. A jet's not fast enough. Yeah, what's faster than a jet? How about a rocket? Sure. Absolutely. Yep, that'll do it. Great. I can't fly a rocket. Yeah, how do you steer and all land that? Yeah. Use the coordinates from the last launch. There you go. Oh, this fucking scene. <laughs> That I need my super suit. Yeah, iconic. Yeah. Absolutely iconic. Uh huh. Where's my super suit? What? Yeah. My super suit! Wait, wait. What? <laughs> Why do you need to know? What the fuck? What? Do you not hear the explosions? She's used to it by now. <laughs> been married to a superhero this whole time. <laughs> yep. We've been planning this dinner for two months. You tell me where my suit is, woman! <laughs> <laughs> so good. This is a rough time for him. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, look, Syndrome is here to save you. <sighs> Symptrome. <Yeah. laughs> is that Byronic? Byronic has a different outfit. Syndrome! <laughs> um, didn't give a shit yeah, about that. Is that. You just assumed no one was there? <laughs> Isn't it a little obvious when this thing doesn't really try to... Banners! Oh my god, wow, dude. Just pathetic oh. lopping. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh! Yep. Nice. Of course, because it fucking learns. Yeah. Idiot. He's not the smartest dude. Nope. Yeah. Oh, dude. Still doesn't Seriously. think this shit through. Oh, God. Poor Helen. <laughs> <laughs> she got her limits. Yeah. Are we there yet? We get there when we get there. <laughs> How you doing, honey? That's the answer! 
Yeah. Yeah. God damn. Helen's got gains. <laughs> I appreciate the took the truck though. Yeah. Not well, coming handy. It's a family movie yeah. after all. <laughs> this is gonna be rough. Yeah, you'd think that'd be super rough. Oh yeah. I think maybe she could have parachuted them in a little bit too. I know we're already asking a lot, but still. <laughs> no, I feel like she could have done that. Yeah. yeah. Which exit do I take? Traction Avenue. That'll take me downtown. Don't take seven! Exit attraction. That'll take me downtown. <laughs> For real though, if you're asking someone to give you directions, just go with the directions they give you. If you don't want to take them to their directions, don't ask. Yeah, freaking hell. I just family dynamic mm. in the superhero genre yeah. is the best combo. Yeah. Period. <laughs> I do appreciate it. It's one of the things I liked about uh, Black Lightning and Superman Lois. Yeah. The family dynamic. Yeah. Batman mm -hmm. too. Best yep. moments when Batman's being a dad to mm. his fucking sidekicks. Sure. <laughs> is everybody okay back there? <laughs> Super duper dad. Yeah. Yeah, they'll be fine. Wait here and stay hidden. I'm going in. What? I watch helplessly from the sideline? Yeah, come on. Wait with the kids. And I'm telling you, not a chance. I love the reasoning behind this. I have to do this alone. Yeah, but what? The kids? Oh. So you can be Mr. Incredible again? No! Then I'm not strong enough. Strong enough. Oh. That's what this is? Some sort of workout? I is this really all just about each of them individually and their feelings? They don't give a shit about the kids right now? Oh, no, no, no. She agrees with the kids staying behind. I just think she doesn't want to stay behind. Yeah, but someone's supposed to be there to take care of the kids. Yeah, true. Usually when someone goes off, it's like, T you do the important thing of keeping our children safe mm. while I go risk my life. Yeah. Instead of us both risking our lives mm. so that the kids are soon orphaned. Yeah. Yeah, that's a fair point. They are both superheroes. So I guess they both she thinks like they're both capable or it's that she's about capable. helping to decrease the chances of him dying if he has, you know, it if he's got matter. help. You gotta be prepared. Yeah. This is just a great way to leave them orphaned. Yeah. I can't lose you again. Yeah. I love that. I do appreciate that part, but what about losing the kids? <laughs> <laughs> no, but I love that it wasn't a macho thing. I love no, that I know. it really was just him I don't know what'll happen. realizing what's important. Sure. We're superheroes. What could happen? Stop saying that. Yeah. <laughs> it's just a foolish sentence. Yeah. Good thing that they work well together. Yeah. <laughs> Oof. Oof. Yeah. Dad! Hey, run, buddy. Yep. And that's nice, but seriously, run. <laughs> yeah. I love how the mum is the one running. No, dash, grab Violet, you run away. Yeah. Please stay here. No. Yeah. Run out of the city. Yeah, that's not far enough. <laughs> <laughs> I know that they're super powered kids. Yeah. It doesn't matter, they're still children. They're not experienced enough. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Frozo. Hey! Such a good name. <laughs> Hey, robot, I'm talking to you! <laughs> Syndrome's remote! Yeah, I think that'd be still somewhat useful. To do mm, Dickhead. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you deserve that. You did, yeah. Maybe don't yell it out. The remote controls the robot! Well, somewhat, because it's still thinking for itself to a degree now. Ah uh, yes, the proud superhero tradition of endangering children. Absolutely. <laughs> yeah. Take out its guns! Obviously it's fine for the story and shit. <laughs> nice. Very useful. <laughs> I appreciate the Frozone, just like, you know what? It doesn't matter how fast this kid is, he ain't got it. Yeah, no. <laughs> you ain't shit, kid. <laughs> <laughs> Noise. Yeah. Ah! Ah! <laughs> A Star Wars tactic. I know, I was just thinking of that. I've got it, I've got the remote! Someone want to do something with it? A remote that controls what? Um, apparently nothing these days. Oh. <laughs> some things. <laughs> nothing these days. Yeah. <laughs> the only thing hard enough to penetrate it is... Itself? Mm -hmm. Good callback. Yeah. Don't you think that they would have fixed this? as an issue. I thought that was the whole point of using the superheroes to test out the robots. Yeah, right? Yeah. <laughs> but uh, apparently not. Yeah. Press that button again! First button, got it! Well, yeah, Omite just thought, oh, if it killed Mr. Incredible, then it must be ready. <laughs> so clearly just his own fucking grudge. Oh, absolutely. Leading him through it. Yeah. What are you waiting for? A closer target! Everybody die! Nice. I can understand why they wanted to get closer. That was like a pretty wild type of shot to take. Oh yeah, yeah. you want to make sure you got the best chance possible. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 
What? Yeah, I don't know why it exploded. The last one didn't explode. Yeah, I would have been fine if it just kind of set on fire. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah, okay. Just like oh. old times. <laughs> yeah, hurt then too. Yep. Yeah. Jesus, buddy. Backsteps tend to hurt. Frozen all of Syndrome's assets. People of this country are indebted to you. You can come out of hiding? Well, let the politicians figure that one out. Mm, sort of. <laughs> I have a question about Jack-Jack. I'm going to say she has many questions about Jack-Jack. Yeah. You're wearing your hair back. Huh? It looks good. Thanks, Dad. It was getting in the way. Yeah, <laughs> covering half her freaking face. Yeah. That was so cool when you threw that car. You're running on water. When you snagged that bad guy with your arm, like, kind of... Uh, Jack-Jack? No, sorry. What's his name? Dash. Dash. Shut up. <laughs> that was the best vacation ever! I love our family. <laughs> Buddy, that was not a vacation. Only because you survived. <laughs> yeah. Papa, you need to call me. I'm gonna call the police. Yeah, I don't think the cops can help. Yeah, no. Your baby has special needs. She <laughs> special needs. Thanks for sending a replacement sitter. Replacement? I didn't call a replacement. This one really polite young lady. Oh, yes. <laughs> mm -hmm. Just had her whole fucking, you know, room fucked up or whatever's going yeah, on yeah, there. Yeah. The baby's sleeping. <laughs> this was a nice little yeah. last bit to round it out. Sure. Oh, don't worry. I'll be a good mentor. Supportive, encouraging. Everything you weren't. Who knows? You yeah. might make a good sidekick. I don't think a supportive or encouraging mentor would have made a difference here. You are yeah. delusional. Yes. <laughs> what you needed was a bit more reality check. Yeah. <laughs> Someone to support you on your mental health journey. Yes, yes, that's a good way to put it. <laughs> Sleep on! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Dude, baby. Throw something! I can't, I might hit Jack Jack. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't think you guys have to worry. He's fine. <laughs> yeah, Jack Jack's taking care of this. Yeah. But yeah, for real, just throw Elastigirl. Yeah. Bob, throw me! Um, I'll meet you on the way up. Yep. Way down, whatever. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Love that. I will get your son eventually! Oh my god, yeah. This <laughs> is the end of the oh. bit. The next thing. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the oh, cape. oh my god. The cape. Yeah. Oh, dude. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, surprisingly dark movie. Although, people have survived that. Everything is all right. Seriously? Yeah. Fucking hell. That's my girl. Does this mean we have to move again? Maybe. That was totally wicked! Shut up, kid. <laughs> the whole house just got destroyed. <laughs> no. <laughs> Do we have to have cheerleaders at the track meet? I always thought it was more about hey. the... Hey. Hey. Violet, right? That's me. Just interrupt. Sure. Mm -hmm. Rude. <laughs> you look different. Is different okay? Different is... <clears throat> different is great. Would you... Uh, uh, yeah. Do, do you think, you know... Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You're dating now. Whatever. Cool. No. I like movies. There you go. Yeah, yeah. Hey, wait, wait, wait. Friday? Friday. Friday. Like them rounding out her emotional arc with getting a date with a boy is kind of kind of weak, but at least it's like her coming out of a shell, you know? Honestly, I'm just getting tired of seeing how awkward flirting is always the way with everyone. I, I, like, I get it. I'm not yeah. saying it's not realistic. Yeah, I, yeah, yeah. I'm just getting tired of seeing it. Overrepresented. <laughs> I mean, like, it takes forever, and I'm like, yes. Get on with it. Right. You like each other. Whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. You know what I mean? It takes up too much time. Yeah, absolutely. Fair it's enough. like 30 seconds later. Like, hey, <laughs> yes, you're going to date. We get it. Fuck. Yes. Okay. Dash, I'm so you. proud of you. Know what the heck do you want me to do? Cheating piece of shit. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, fucking mole man or whatever. Yeah. <laughs> this beneath me! I really would have appreciated if they got Danny DeVito. Right. <laughs> oh, that would have been so good. Especially knowing like his role as Frank in It's Always Sunny. Yeah, it's basically this. that. You're just <laughs> wild, creepy weirdo. Yes. <laughs> well, that right there is The Incredibles. That's a good movie. If what anything, a classic superhero film. Yeah, possibly one of the best superhero movies ever. I think it's at least valid to ask the question. Mm, yeah. You know, obviously, there's going to be a real strong amount of subjectivity there. Oh, yeah, absolutely. You know what I'm saying? Uh, for me, it's still, you know, Spider-Verse mm -hmm. on top of everything yeah, else. Totally totally but fair. I can yeah. definitely see how this being kind of like a quintessential movie of the superhero genre, mm -hmm. broadly speaking. Mm -hmm. Yeah, definitely a strong contender. I don't know if I have a favorite superhero movie, but maybe. My favorite superhero thing, mm. Peacemaker. 
Oh yeah, I think it's legitimately my favorite superhero thing right now. Mm. Peacemaker is so fucking good. I've heard it's very good. But The Incredibles. I mean, I think that honestly, the points you made about the family and their powers are probably one of the more interesting things. Yeah, exactly. Right. It's not like it massively changes the tone of the movie or anything like that. But it's just like a oh cool. That's why this makes sense. It just makes more sense now. Uh, Next week it should be our members poll choice. Mm -hmm. Um, Not sure 100% what it's going to be. It's looking like it's either the greatest showman or the Maze Runner. By the time we post this, yeah, I'm sure we'll, we'll have an idea. But um, until then, you've been with Sam, Steph, and my other movie buds. buds.